Hi babes, how are you? If you're new, how welcome. My name is Michelle and today we're going with our requested um, reading of I believe Shyla in um, Landon McQuillum, I think his name was or is. Um, <laughs> um, you guys wanted me to read on what happened on the timeline that they were dating and all of that. So with this said, uh, let's move forward. I want to remind you guys that my readings have no date. They are divinely guided. Everything has free will. Not everything is going to resonate with everybody. Please keep in mind that roles could be reversed in between energies. And um, as I always say, readings on celebrities or influencers are always for entertainment purposes only. Everything said I mentioned is allegedly throughout the whole video. Alleged. So every time, you know, uh, we always offer you guys the legal disclaimer in English and Spanish for anybody interested in reading the disclaimers so with this said let's move forward yes i'm losing my voice so i can't shout so with this said that's that so we got here the nine of cups in reverse ten of pentacles in reverse the lovers we got here the five of swords you're gonna hear my son in the background he's playing so um, we got here the King of Wands in the reverse. Um, we got Six of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and at the bottom we got the Emperor in the reverse. Gemini, Aries, Taurus, Vigo, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Now, what happened here is, first, the situation between them was, yeah, they were in love in a way to perform, but allegedly, this guy, he wanted to recreate, allegedly, the Ace family with his own family, allegedly, with his own baby mama and whatnot. He wanted, allegedly, to recreate that, to try to be like the brother because of the income and everything, and to where, you know, she, she liked to create content like that, but... Um, she was also understanding that, hey, we are a couple, we are a, a family, whatnot. But it, it became too much of a business at that point. At this point, uh, also allegedly, uh, allegedly Austin was like, you know, kind of like she felt like allegedly he was too involved in the relationship. Um, into where, again, he wanted his brother allegedly to become like him, like create a family channel like him, create a content like him. And, you know, and at this point, it was allegedly for her being hard to be her own person. And it was hard to have a relationship with somebody who, you know, was treating the relationship like a business and a business only. At this point, allegedly here, there was a uh, alleged uh, flirtatious of his side towards other people, um, you know, unfaithfulness allegedly here on his side. Uh, he didn't treat her properly, of course, with the, uh, you know, alleged uh, flirting with other people that's disrespectful enough. With the Ace of Swords, she started questioning if this was worth the relationship. Like, she's like, oh, is this worth the, the situations is this worth me feeling like this is this worth me being cheated on is this worth you know questioning if it was worth it but at this point she was wrapped around people who allegedly were manipulative towards her because they wanted her to be like oh no you're in the wrong we're in the right so at this point it was like um mental abuse at one point allegedly with the ace of cups right here um at this point she when before she broke the things things up with him allegedly with the hermit she virgo energy she hold on to the memory she hold on to allegedly her emotions she hold on to like what they used to be but it seems to be that allegedly that that person she allegedly fell in love with in the first place became more and more distant by the time they were together and she started to dislike allegedly the way he acted and the disrespect and the way he treated their relationship because it was she felt like she watched in a reality show most likely um with the five of cups in the reverse right here yeah this was major cheating allegedly towards her and other and towards her uh, with somebody that she allegedly knew so at this point uh, she was extremely disappointed and she um, you know was the mother of his kid and all of that he will continue allegedly acting like that and she realized that he was not going to change and she realized that it was not something she wanted to be in you know she didn't want that for herself so at this point she decided to walk away from him 
with the eight of swords at one point she felt like she couldn't get out allegedly with the eight of swords uh there were like uh conversations and whispers allegedly of legal issues and all of that allegedly threatening here and there allegedly here trying to keep her shush because there was a lot of things that she does know that she hasn't even talked about but at the time right she knew too much and allegedly they were afraid that she was going to disrupt this like disrupt his reputation and allegedly the ace family's reputation especially allegedly austin's at the time so at this point uh it was too much secrets also that they didn't want uh to be spilled but the thing is like every sibling um allegedly you know being connected to the ace family wanted to make an ace family of their own you know and at this point um acted like entitled and all of that and allegedly she was not about that she was too real for that she's a fake and when he started allegedly disrespecting her and all that she said you know what um it's not for me um i do see allegedly that she felt betrayed not only by her her man but also allegedly by by Catherine as well she felt betrayed and allegedly um she felt alone she felt like nobody was having her back and at this point it was just a business falling apart and a lot of secrets allegedly that they wanted to make sure it was a secret and i do feel like everybody was allegedly like pushing like you can't say this you can't say that um it was just secrets that now they're not a secret no more into where allegedly is Catherine, Catherine's unhappiness and all of that and all the things that allegedly she witnessed that not only they came out now but allegedly that will be coming out very soon as well with more details about the breakup and whatnot so i do feel like the situation that was trying to keep her from keeping up with the truth at the time was the things that are coming out to light now and that are going to continue to come to light connected to the ace family allegedly but it was nothing bigger than that um uh, uh, allegedly there's people that said oh she wasn't faithful it was not true allegedly it was not true because again they had an understanding at one point and they were not together at the, at the time allegedly but it was because of how things were handled and the pressure she felt nothing bigger than that um allegedly like i said before they said that she cheated or so but allegedly it's not true it was because they weren't worried that the business and the facade allegedly and everything they created was coming to it was gonna fall apart but you know you can always hold a lie for so long and allegedly you know for example the ace family no more is no longer the ace family like we used to know it so allegedly it was just that nothing bigger than that so um that's that let me finalize this reading today here with this dices we're gonna go with the house the zodiac sign in the uh, in the in the area of life so the house i'm sorry the the planet represents the situation and we got here um we got here neptune um it says let's see what it says pertaining to the shadow of the mind intuitive force not of this world then we got the zodiac sign the zodiac sign says uh the emotional side and we got here virgo it says taking on too much isolation overly rational um anxious focusing too much on details overly organized and overwhelmed and last one is the 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 houses which is the area of life where we got the sixth house for them represents health day-to-day -day activities hygiene routines can also relate to pet care or co-workers so with this said guys thank you so much this is the end of the video i hope you guys like it please don't forget to like and subscribe you can also follow me on other platforms which is spotify you can follow me on tiktok instagram facebook and i also offer personal readings for all the links are going to be in the description box below love you guys so much